This Raw Vision video is brought to you by Metro Solar, proud partner of the Richmond Football Club. All right, lady, just over two weeks until uh, the first NAB Cup game in Mandurah. What's the focus between now and then for the midfield group in training? Uh, yeah, it's just developing our fitness still. You know, we've had a, a good block up to now. Um, got a couple of weeks to go before NAB won and really want to hone the fitness and the skills for the midfield to uh, you know, lead into the Fremantle game. Out on the track in match simulation at the moment. There's plenty of feeling out there. Are the boys looking forward to unleashing some of that aggression on an opposition team soon? Yeah, I'm a bit worried about more in towns and uh, going at our players too hard at the moment. But look, it's really good for, for the group to have a couple of players like that in there and putting that pressure on. Um, Koch and Amal has been going really well through that, through that area as well. So um, we're looking forward to see how our midfield is going to shape up going into NAB 1 and Round 1. You mentioned uh, more in towns and then what dynamic have they brought to the group this year? Yeah, Moore has added a little bit of flexibility with his run and toughness in the middle. He can play inside and outside, which is handy for us. I um, mean, Town is just the competitive beast, loves the contact, loves uh, trying to hurt people. Uh, hasn't done that much at, uh, at our guys yet, but hopefully does against the oppo. This time of year, supporters are looking for any grab they can get for the young up-and-comers or the second-tier players looking to push on. Who out of those guys have really impressed you so far this year? Connor's probably he's in his second year in Corey Ellis. Connor's playing on the wing and really starting to stand out a little bit. He's had uh, put on a little bit of weight as well, which is handy, um, but using the ball really well. Uh, Corey had his first game on Monday, so he's just coming through that and got through well, and uh, we look for bigger and better things from Corey too. I guess we don't ever underestimate the senior and core group of players here at the club. How are they tracking, and have you seen much improvement from them over the pre-season as well? Yeah, a lot of our uh, core players had to learn different roles as well, with the rotations coming down. It's, it's harder for the, for the group to be able to have as many rests as I did last year, so... I think a lot of teams will be doing the same thing and you know, learning a lot of different positions. So um, our other guys, you know, if they're just midfielders, they're learning a different position as well. So um, it's exciting at the moment and we'll see how it goes when we go into the games for real. Thanks, Brendan. Thanks, mate.